I mean, we played well with the puck. Uh, I think we got to yeah, learn to play better without the puck. I think uh, we really didn't give them anything uh, other than when we handed it to them. I think um, that's probably the biggest uh, lesson to, to take from this game. And uh, We were dominating pretty well, but we were giving up uh, big chances when uh, when we were, we got impatient, so we got to be uh, be better at that. Feels like there's still sometimes a start to periods where where the focus might be up just a little bit. Is that your sense? Uh, I don't know if it's just that, but it's just uh, yeah the way we we're not patient. We uh, I mean, like I said, we had the puck a lot and cycling as well, and and then all of a sudden we we give up breakaways. But uh, we got to yeah we got to just stick with it and 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 find ways to yeah to. to change well and, and keep coming at him that way we will score more and uh, and like the result better. Babcock said the other day players get break breakaways in a game and goalies face them. There's something about getting to shoot out where it feels differently. Do you think there's something to that? Uh, yeah, I think I think in breakaways in the game you, you're more in, more in the flow of the game and uh, shoot out you. They kind of have all day to, to kind of figure out what they want to do. So. Uh, the, those are two different things. I think. How has your approach changed to a shootout over the last couple of seasons? Um, I don't know if it's changed. I think I just uh, yeah, try to read what they want to do. And Usually uh, goalies don't uh, speak during the game. Last night you and Mike Smith passed, passed each other. You whacked each other on the pads after that overtime. Because you were obviously a little bit of mutual respect there for what happened. That was a pretty exciting three on three. Yeah, I think uh, I think everyone wanted to keep uh, keep going to play. and. Uh, all the fans would probably love to see see more of that. Uh, I think uh, it's, it's exciting to watch, and especially when go, when you go back and forth like that. And I think everyone's on their the edge of the seat. So um, yeah, that was uh, that was a fun one. Did you say anything to him or just tap that? No, it was just uh, yeah, the good job, I guess. Fred Peter said uh, when he was going down, he was trying to think what you were thinking and vice versa. Was it a bit of a chess match mentally as uh, he got ready to take yeah. the shot on you? Yeah, I think so. I think he. I know he, he likes a uh, similar move, but, but pulling in the forehand, so yeah. he uh, I think he got me there, but uh, yeah, that was, it was a good move. It trickled in and obviously would have loved to stop it, but um, yeah, those, those, you've got, those things happen. Sorry, you've got Crosby now. Oops, I know you haven't probably seen him as much as some guys, but what stands out about him still for you about his game as a whole? I mean, he's just a yeah, complete player. I think mm -hmm. uh, there's nothing really to point at uh, where he's not... Uh, one of the best in the league at everything, so he, uh, yeah, he has, uh, he's a good team around him too. So it's uh, it's not just him; he's got a lot of got a lot of good players in that team. And another team the Leafs have played down there in a game they could have won. It seems this club is capable of competing with the very best in this league, and it's just a few details that have to be sorted out. Yeah, I think we're we're definitely a good team with the puck, and I think, like I said before, we we got to learn to to minimize our our gifts to the other teams. I think. Uh, we get in trouble when we start giving the puck away and, and, and get impatient. I think we just gotta yeah, learn to stick with it and uh, stay the course of our game plan, and, and that way we'll we'll beat uh, we'll beat some teams and um, not give up as many chances. Did you see that hit uh, last night by Egan on Hunter Blomqvist behind the net at all? Uh, yeah, I did. I think uh, yeah, he got <laughs> got a lot of him there. So I mean, I don't know what uh, what the decision is going to be on that, but it was. Uh, it's tough to see um, guy go after a goal like that, but um, I don't know if he's trying to get the puck at all. So.